Um, what the hell am I doing? All right, everyone. Uh, welcome to the Ancient Gods Part One. I know I'm a little bit. I'm both uh, late to the party on Ancient Gods One, and also, I also realize I haven't played through Doom 2016 or Eternal on my channel yet. So I'm kind of both late and jumping the gun. But I couldn't wait any longer. Um, I'm ready to play these finally. I played about an hour of Ancient Gods One. Um, a few months ago and then stopped and now I'm finally coming back to it so uh, here we go knew it was here. Sir, weather's disrupting the signal, but we'll be able to teleport him onto the rig's main deck. Uh, Dr. Hayden, ready to launch the package, sir. Whenever you're ready. We cannot regain control of Erdak without the Seraphim's help. You broke the seal when you awakened the Icon of Sin in their world. The balance between their two dimensions has been broken with the demons now in control of Erdak. Portal ready in three, two... Alright, it's been a minute since I played this, so let me try and get my bearings real quick. Got the Unmaker. So I guess we have the Unmaker now. Digging in the base game, I don't think. I don't remember it, anyways. Shield. It looks like they changed the hug a little bit too. Um, if you notice around the uh, the crosshair is different. It looks like anyways. And um, those two symbols around it are different too. Like uh, the one on the right is obviously the ga the fuel, the gas for the uh, chainsaw. I'm not sure what the yellow skull is for. Anyways, let's go. The UAC won't hand over the Seraphim without a fight. Mancubus right off the bat.
That could have gone better, but whatever. Revenant. Now the uh, it's showing I have two levels of punch uh, below the yellow skull. Um, I still don't know what the yellow skull means. So now I can just look at the the hug, the crosshair, I guess, instead of looking in the bottom left corner like normal to see that I have a punch. Um, I don't know, I don't really see how that's like super extra beneficial. I don't need chainsaw. Oh, armor though. Okay. Another Mancubus. Ah! I keep hitting the wrong button. <laughs> yeah, that, that didn't go too great. Is this the rocket launcher? I can't remember what the mods are for that. Remote detonate. Lock on burst. I don't know which one I'm on right now though, but... Okay, I was on remote detonate. There we go. Those ones, if you haven't played, are mini rockets. There's a blue spear, but I don't know how to get to it. I always need shotgun ammo. For the, uh, again, this is for people that haven't played uh, Eternal. Um, for the assault rifle, you can either mini rockets or snipe sniping takes uh six bullets though and i'm down to 24 we're gonna switch it back to the shotgun real quick hell knight right now i'm using grenade launcher attachment with the shotgun the key right do I go back upstairs okay so for the shotgun grenade launcher or full auto and there's an arachnatron Shotgun shells. There's a cyber mancubus. Uh, if you blood punch him, you knock off all of his armor. Shoot. I need to glory kill somebody before I die. 
I'm not sure if it's gonna happen though. Ah! Gog it. Glory kill and then a health pack and then another glory kill. Ah. Ah, I shot one too many times. Hell yeah. Do the same to your friend back here. Maybe not. Ah, the Kakademon decides to join. And I f fell off the fucking thing. Oh, okay. And I fell off the thing again. Ah, the Mancubus. Okay, now the thing about... Ah. I was about to say the thing about Mancubuses, or not Mancubuses, uh, Cockle Demons, Caca Demons, is, uh, yeah, like it's gonna show here. You can launch a grenade into their mouth and they'll swallow it, and then when the grenade goes off in their body, you can instantly glory kill them. Okay, so it started me back here. I know that a Cyber Macu is gonna come up this way, right? And just turn me into a liar, why don't you? Um, what the hell am I doing? I don't even know what I did there, guys. Microwave. Hold on a sec. Just because it's been a minute. Microwave. And then heat blast. I was on heat blast. I find microwave more useful, but for the plasma rifle, they're both. I love the plasma rifle, but both the uh, attachments are kind of useless, in my opinion. Shouldn't have done that. That wasted all my blood punch. Okay, I have one back. See? And then you can instantly glory kill them. I didn't think I was going to get to him in time. Ah, I'm out of ammo. Er, no I'm not. Why didn't it let me do that? Okay. Ooh. 
For those who haven't played, that was the chainsaw. It insta kills and it drops ammo. You get three charges at a time. Um, strength of demon determines how many charges it takes to kill. Like I was full and then I killed the Arachnitron and then I had picked one up and now I have one left. Which means that it took uh, all three charges to kill the Arachnitron. I definitely could have handled that one better, but whatever. Get this armor too. y'all get oh jeez um best way to handle this is probably the rocket launcher there we go I don't So it won't lock on from this far back. He looks bloody, right? Like I'm connecting? Okay, yeah, I'm definitely connecting. Okay, there we go. I hate platforming. I hesitate there. Oh, blue sphere. Alright, I'm glad I hesitated then. Dope. Alright, cool. Alright, here goes nothing. Dope. Yeah, they knew we were going to use the rocket launcher for that Arachnitron weak point turret. Now I'm going to end this right here. I'm going to try and keep each video about 20 minutes long just um, because I personally have trouble watching gameplay videos that are longer than 20 minutes usually. Um, each level is over an hour long, so it's probably going to be about three maybe even four uh, videos per level um my channel's not monetized so i mean i'm not making any money off of this anyway so i'm not doing this for extra views or clips or anything like that it's just to keep it short and simple but anyways we'll see you back here next time hope you're enjoying it so far